Oops, I'm gonna burn their units. Oh well. Welcome back everybody to episode 18 of this Let's Play series of Age of Wonders Planetfall. We are on the planet of Ivaria Z. It's another Lava Pangea world. We're using Promethean Shikarn led by Candle Quick. And we just had a huge battle in the last episode where we got to use our new Phoenix Walkers, the regen bots. They were, um, they weren't even novice rank. They were recruit rank and they kicked the shit out of everything. And they all ended the battle with like almost full health because they're ridiculous. So their support staff did a great job mucking about while they did most of the work. It was absolutely amazing. We killed a lot of stuff. And I think we're just going to move towards their capital with probably like these four and these two. Or just all of them. Who knows? Let's just go take them out. I don't think we can be stopped. So we stopped here last episode because I think I'm going to have another fight. Yep. Okay. Manual combat. Here we go. We're defending Tiri Kozrax's city. This city is hot garbage. And it looks like the balance of power is not in my favor and I may lose this. I'm going to be doing all the heavy lifting in this fight. These are slightly outmoded versions of things. They don't have all of the extra buffs. They have some of them. Some of them, but they don't have all of the cool extra buffs that we get from our units we make now. Uh, we don't have any of our cool Phoenix Walkers. This is actually a hero in a Phoenix watch Walker, which should be better than that, but it's worse because of how strong the Phoenix Walkers are that I can pop out. Tiri has some weird stuff going on here. Let's just get, I don't know. Let me group up here and take care of my own. Got our two versions of our dead eyes, the blast wave and the crack shot. They're very different functions in the army. Do you have regeneration? No, but you do have regeneration on fire, right? Standing in thermal hazards, this unit deals more damage and heals 12 at the start of each turn. Start of each turn, okay. So we can't just rush blindly in. We'll probably use one of these to launch a firebomb at the ground, and then we run in with the Phoenix Walker hero so we can uh, heal. I'm not going to bother going into Overwatch. I'd rather go into defense mode. I don't think they're going to get to attack or get close enough. I wish we had the hive guard towers feel a little bit better about the fight the towers are kind of garbage but it does sort of form a natural defense line and it they have a nine range so it always sort of forces the enemy to wait this is an oathbound city but we'd be getting precog so all right we're forming up on the walls that's good they've got a hidden that's very nice a very strange hidden Okay, let's speed this up, guys. Come on. Yeah, a bunch of stuff. Let's go to two times speed so I can see what's happening. Yeah, the precog. Yep. Enhanced targeting. Oh, that's so interesting. It's like they know where to stop during siege attacks because of the turret range, but there's no turrets here. And even if there were, they, they don't attack, they heal my people. That's interesting. Operations available for priming. Um, this is juice right here. This is mega juice. This does no damage, what the fuck? Because they have like a billion armor. Holy hell, what am I gonna do here? Blind? Mind would be good. What else can we do? Destroying four shield? That's not... I mean, it's helpful. I wish I could blast armor away instead. What's this do? Disoriented, giving it a chance to fumble. Pretty good disorient chance, but... Let's do the blinding instead. That's, that's a lot of value. We blinded five units. Oh boy. I may need to wait another turn to move in. I hope Terry's not gonna run in like an idiot. Okay, let's scoot up just a little bit. I want them to get a little bit closer. May need to prepare to, to jump in and do some firing from closer range. 
No, you know what? Up here, there's going to be some lots of juicy targets. Same with here. Should I go into Overwatch? I think so. Okay, let's wait one more turn. If I was the vanguard, I could deploy that, that really cool nanite healing thing right there. I just never play vanguard. Oh, nice. Good shot. We still have a lot of work to do here. So here's the plan for this turn. So we're gonna move up one hex. Do this. Um, we're gonna do something similar here. Just trying to spread as much fire as possible. Even though we're getting precog, but now we can run up like so and do this thing, which is very cool. Get everybody burning. Now I'm standing in fire, so I'll heal. Um, hmm. Okay, we got some burning there. Excellent. Got some statuses on there. Now here. Let's go up to here. That one doesn't have any armor to, to lose. This one does. Go ahead and take a shot. There we go. We want to use another operation. I think we probably do. This battle is kind of important to win. If I don't, if we don't win this, then I lose all of my influence up here interior's entire army. We have this replicating restoration thing I can use that's can dispel effects. Could be something we use here like this. Dispel effects from Tyri's units. Pretty helpful. Get them back up a little bit. Now it's Tyri's turn. Tyri, please make smart decisions. Wait, Tyri's actually here! I didn't realize Tyri was here. I thought this was just like his militia and random units. Finely tuned, okay. Oh, in case, that's good, that's a stun. Fatalism is good. So far, so good. Okay, so a lot of buffs and debuffs going on here. I can do the damage, they can they can stall. This is gonna work good. Battle for the slaughter. Work good. All right, Cyneric. A lot of good damage up there. This okay, well, that was just militia, I think. Oh no. Oh, that's a lot of fire. Good, good, good. Okay. Okay, this is looking good. So who do we want to crack armor off of? These paladins. Yeah, here we go. This one. 
Excellent. That one's, yeah. Losing defenses is great. I think we're going to need to shore this side up soon because there's a lot of units coming in and we just don't have the forces for this. But there's not a lot I can do about it at the moment. Um, let's ignore that one. Can we get in close enough for a hit? Yeah, we're immune to the hazards on the ground. the grenade throw range one two three one two three this isn't a bad place to stand because they can't they can't surround me. excellent okay a lot of staggering that's good one point left that's gonna be saved all right, Terry. Let's get down to regular speed. I just I don't want to miss. Was this a Terry unit? Oh, it was. Where'd you come from? I thought you were dead. Cattle for the slaughter. It'll be down. Staggered and disabled. Great. Oh, increase the chance. Oh my god, they made the disable last another turn. That's three turns of disabling on that mech. Nice, some arc damage. That's good. Wasting your time shooting the one that's already stunned for three turns. So they might be able to clear it. I don't know. Terry, I thought you would deal with these banners. I left these for you. Staggered itself out. There you go, enjoy. Oh, and his precog on it. Oh no, Terry. You'll be lost. Okay, we're gonna have to pull this unit back, I think. Ooh. Ooh, that one as well, maybe. Can't lose these units. Because reinforcements will be a long way away, especially without any Cosmite. If I go back to here, I can still shoot this one's armor off. This one has last stand, so there's no reason to do anything about this one. Let's, we can just kind of park it right here. Actually, this side is... Now well, there's three, four units left over here, but they have a lot of their forces. Uh, I'll send, I'll send one unit over. Oops, let's not do that because I can't get around that cover. Let's see if the impairing grenade helps here. Yeah, it does. Cool. Oh, it impairs there. <laughs> cool. Okay, so you guys are in a pretty fine place, actually. So what do we want to do here? If we move over to here, how can we, can we blast? No, they're perfectly spaced out for this. Impairing grenades is fantastic. Look at this. It destroys, it stops all of their mods. It's so nice. So let's go to here, and then we're gonna missile them 
No line of sight. Uh, right here. Don't scatter, don't scatter, don't scatter, don't scatter. Nice. So that way, when this one, this one is Curse of Fatalism, or not Curse of Fatalism, the, um, the hell is this called? Last Stand. So it's gonna remain at one health instead of dying, so I cannot kill it. Uh, so if I, but then on their turn, they'll heal, I think 20, and then try to walk away, and they'll take another opportunity, which won't kill them, but at least they'll take that and get staggered again. So I think, I think we're all set over here. Can we, anything need cleansed? Four effects on these guys? What's wrong with you? Atrophy does less damage. I'm not worried about that. Emergency shielding. The unit cannot move for the duration. Stagger immunity and thermal immunity. There we go. 11 shield. All right, Terry, you know, don't be stupid and attack this one up here that's invulnerable. Instead, run into melee with your snipers. Enemy Great. Ooh. Oh, that one has last stand. It activated, it looked like. I wonder what does that, a mod? That's the second time those particular units have been encased, isn't it? They don't get to play this game. Enemy down. Last stand again. Oh yeah, the disgraced mod. Yeah, 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 okay, I know about that. And then they do less, less damage or they don't get experience or something if they survive. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm going to do two times speed here. Oh, they'll die at the end of their turn. That's excellent. Stop focusing on those. Yes. Oh, Ouch. Leave one point. Oops, I'm going to burn their units. Oh, well. Alright, who's left? This banner, this guy with last stand, this one, this banner. These banners don't matter, but I guess I might as well kill him. Get precog. No, it doesn't. Just got the eye symbol. Alright, finish him off, Tiri. Well, actually, we have to wait until the last stand wears off. Enemy destroyed. Terry, you can't, you can't kill that one. Enemy down. Excellent. Cool. Um, it looks like Terry didn't lose any real units, lost only militia, and I didn't lose any real units. So that was even better than I thought it would go. 
Thought we would struggle to defend this city. They had superior power, but Okay, now all these units are maximum rank, which is except for this one. That's very very cool. So now there's their capital, and we just killed their faction leader, right? Was their faction leader there? Maybe not. Well, it looks like they're getting ready to move. Oh yeah, they are. Can I can I take it? Hang on, can I go? Let me just can I just Terry, can I go? Do you mind if I take a Terry, can I just Okay. Stick with them. Autonom faction demand, that's it's fine. I make a lot of money. Three heroes here. Really don't like this. Four heroes actually down here in this area. A little bit ridiculous. There's their capital. It's got an incredible militia in it. Do we have the power to win this? don't know. It might be close. But if we can do it, they're out of the game. So I think we try. Operations Prime. I think you can launch this on militia. Yes, you can. Okay, so then we take, I mean, all of these units, really, right? Or just the best of them? And we go down to this, this character's capital and we just kill them. We take all of these. And we'll probably mix the units up a little bit. Here we go. We'll just take all of those. We'll leave these two behind. Grab up all of these pretty bad items here. Drizzler's okay. I don't have any real mods that work with it, but that's okay. You guys can wait here and be defense force. Keep making troops here. We'll leave a couple troops in the capital for now, um, just in case. I don't know what's coming. So now we have to make some unmodded units. We don't have any. We don't have anything to defend. Uh, what do we want to build? We have a lot of income, but low standing money. The dead eyes are much better. Maybe some basic purifiers. I mean, launching the plasma bombs is pretty good. I could get more Cosmite. They're still thinking about settling over there, I think. Nyla and Chili are neutral towards each other. Were they... Were they... Hmm. Were they, were they non-aggression or were they neutral? Terry, are you going to get your city back? Operation ready. Maybe we should launch that. Target already under the effect. How did I lose all my money already? What? These don't cost that much. What did I do? Sorry. Maybe I did. Oh, my money went way down. What's happening? It was really high a second ago. Oh, because my capital makes so much money when it's on making money. I see. 
That's why it's hundreds when it's on. Okay, I see, I see. Okay, we got Imperial Renown and some XP. We could actually spend this to buy units out if we want to. Pteranodons or something would be kind of fun, but I don't think I have mods for them still. Unfortunately. Message from the Forgotten. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that right now. I gotta go, I gotta go uh, kill some people. Maybe I do need to make money for a turn. There's so much production queued up though. Oh, I could do a lot of advancements in the city though. Maybe I do that for a second while I'm building up. Um, energy sector upgrade would give me more of a discount on troops, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it would go to 30% cost and 30% upkeep so that could make a big difference and residential and food and virtual entertainment experience perfect okay we just got those I might go and queue those up in some of these other places it takes a long time to build those but I like this because it frees up more slots right you get more happiness income per colonist and more slots. So you, that means, you know, I would get more income per person so I don't need as many people in there. Oh my god, their capital. Uh, they're not fully healed up yet. Do I have any way to heal? I don't. Do we want to try for it? If I win, Chili's dead. Happiness evading colony. Internal purge complete. Okay, so we didn't find any breaches. That's good. What's my operational defense? 20. Tyrese is 21. 21's for Cyneric. 18. Ooh, Dayus is only 14. Chili's is only 10. Oh my god. What happened, Chili? Are right, you guys pause for just a second? Just a second. Tyri Kozrax. I know. Okay, so let me let me see. Well, this quest is invisible because they're right, right. And then how are we doing up here? Oh, they've they've moved out. Okay, so let's let's follow, stay in a formation with them. Looks like they conquered Father's Mount, which is the weirdest sector, uh, and they're headed towards the capital, which is not going to survive these forces coming in. We do have operations ready to launch. Do we have anything we want to queue up? We don't have a ton of money, though. Maybe we want to infiltrate operations center of somebody that we don't have yet. Like Nyla? Oh, success. Oh, we've learned her secret trait, which is generalist. Nyla is this person here that we've only seen one time when they floated us an army of sentinels. For some reason, they went all the way over here and either up this coast, ignoring Tyri's cities that were here, and they went up and took this city, or they like went through the lava, and then somehow I didn't see them, even though I have vision kind of out to here. It's pretty strange. It's pretty strange. Happiness event in colony. Okay. Oh, Cosmite event. Excellent. Good, good. We can get more of these Phoenix Walkers. It cost me 50, but, I mean, we've seen that they're kind of invulnerable. I don't know how you can even stop this unless you shred armor off of it. It's not even the most powerful it can be yet. I mean, I think I can make them better by giving them more damage, which I haven't finished researching yet. Okay. Well, we will... Um, we will do this on the next episode. We will go in and we will try to destroy this capital with just these forces, even though we're a little bit weakened right now. But if we can succeed in doing it, we actually knock this player out of the game altogether, which would be very helpful since I'm at war with four of them. So we will do that on the next episode. We will also march down towards this person's capital. And we're also marching towards this person's capital uh, over here. 
So this could be, uh, next episode could be three capitals taken, which would be very exciting. So thank you everybody so much for watching, and I hope I will see you for the next episode.